Welcome to Sarah's Kitchen. We're going to be making the new craze, which is the waffle pizza um, stuffed with whatever you want it to be. We're going to make ours with pepperoni and cheese, and then we're going to top it off with an egg, a baked egg. So you're going to roll. I'm using the same dough as our simple dough, as our Cinnabon and I put it in the refrigerator for a little bit right before I roll it out just so it doesn't fall apart on me. You don't want to roll it out too thin. Here we go, little discs. You kind of cut them in small pieces, portion them this size to fit your waffle machine. And here's what's gonna happen. I'm gonna roll them out just really thin, as thin as you can and this is fun. We have a live show going on on Instagram and we're taping for our YouTube. So if I'm not reading my Instagram comments, forgive me, but I wanted to give this opportunity to you guys to watch it live. All right, so we roll it out. Make sure you have a couple ready because the waffle machine is just gonna go really quickly. We're gonna top it in there, go quick. Put it on your waffle machine. There we go. I have two, one for the top, one for the bottom. Pizza sauce. You don't have pizza sauce, put your marinara sauce. Here's some cheese. All right, over the pizza dough and the sauce. Put whatever kind of meats you want. I'm putting pepperoni. This is gonna be a small one. It's kind of like individual pizzas. How fast is this? You don't have a pizza oven, you don't really need one. Put it over. You could add more cheese if you want and close it. There, now that's gonna fall apart, which is okay. There we go. Now the top is ready to be filled. Another one. So you don't have a pizza machine or a pizza oven, no worries, stick it in your waffle maker. You don't have a waffle maker, you have those frittata pans, put it in there. So simple. This is the new Instagram craze, so I thought, how fun is that? Now this one, we're gonna add a little bit more cheese on top. Look at that. On top of the pepperoni or salami. I'm using salami, my kids prefer salami on there. And then put more cheese. Bada bim, bada boom. Simple, simple, easy. And then I'm gonna roll out another dough. Remember, this is the simple dough. The recipe is on Instagram and my highlights. I've used it a hundred different ways. And you just pick it up, put it over, and close it. That's it. And then you're gonna pop it in, and then you're gonna break your machine and it won't agree with you. There. Now you're gonna let it sit, turn it up a little bit, the temperature, while the top one is cooking. Scrape off the excess dough that's popping out. Nice and clean. Watch this. Look how it's doing. It's actually cooking. It hasn't beeped, so I'm gonna close it and let it cook. Here's the second one. Ooh, look at that one. Looks good. Now you can play with your temperature on your waffle maker. I turned it up. I left it on medium. It was on three. It goes all the way to six. Now I'm turning it up. It smells so good. Ooh. All right. 
Let's pop it up. Feel it. Oh, that feels so good, the dough. Oh my. I don't know how I'm gonna get under here, Kenna. I think the other one's actually first. It looked like the other one was, right? <gasps> Yummy! Here we go, people. I hope this agrees with me. There's cheese and goo everywhere. This is gonna be my plate. Voila. Look how good that is. <gasps> Yum. Let me flip it over. There's the beeping for the other one. Let's pop that out too. Oh, look at that. This one, the bottom dough, was smaller. You see that, Kenna? Mm -hmm. And it's... There it is. You guys see that? That looks great. I'm gonna turn this off because I'm baking here. It's so hot. Now, what you can do is top it off with some more cheese and put it in the grill and grill it for about five, 10 minutes on high for the cheese to melt over. I'm gonna do that right now. This is cheesy goodness. And I have to taste it while it's still sitting here, the dough. Mmm, honestly, it's so good. All right, guys, I'll be right back. I'm in the waiting. Already melted and gooey, ready for my for my egg. Right? Can somebody help me here, please? Here we go. I did it. I did it. I did it. Giselle, now this one's gonna go in there and melt. There it is. Okay, I'm gonna show you guys now. Dace, can you take this from my hand? This, this my love, take this. Okay, come here. Come on guys. We're gonna do some salt, right? For the egg, we're gonna drizzle some olive oil on it. And then we're gonna do some Crack pepper, right? And then we're gonna cut this puppy. Let's see, which way we're we gonna cut it? Oh, look at that. You can each get an angle. Look at that. Absolute perfection. There it is. All right, I'm gonna take a bite. You guys ready? Mmm, so hot. Mmm, mmm, mmm. All right, everybody, thank you for joining us in Sarah's Kitchen. Please remember to hit subscribe so you get a notification and the bell will ring when I post a new video. 
Uh, don't forget Instagram and Sarah's Kitchen and my website. You will have the link there for all of them. Thanks for joining us and email me or DM me and I will answer all your questions. Thank you, have a great day.